Hello everybody, this is Becca with Eating Your Heart Out with Becca. Welcome back to my channel, my OGs, and welcome to my channel, my newbies. How are you doing? I'm doing all right. Um, feeling a lot better than I did last night and this morning, early this morning. Whew, it was horrible. Anyways, for lunch I had Chipotle. And I also found one piece of corn in the Chipotle bowl that I had, but no other corn. Of course, I didn't. I don't eat corn because it hurts my tummy. Anyways, I'm having leftover some chicken nuggets, KFC chicken nuggets, and some uh, mac and cheese. There's only a little bit. But anyways, all right, Jesus, thank you, Lord, for the, your food, for this food. Amen. And I'm having some hot cocoa, hot chocolate, and some water. So, yes. How are you guys doing? If you would like to be so kind to like, comment, subscribe, hit that notification bell button, turn on all your notifications so you get notified of all my uploads, and uh, share my videos if you like. Um, and also, if you would like to donate and help out, my cash app is um, lowercase b for Becca, Becca, and then uppercase m for mist, like the mist, like mist, Becca mist 38. All right, well, thank you very, very, very much. I'm just eating it cold. Um, the cats were in the way eating and I didn't just wanna, you know, I was like, you know what, it's okay. So anyways, I'm sure it's gonna still be good even though it's cold, right? You know, it's cold. The first bite. Not bad. I do say I think it's better caught, but it's okay. <laughs> Bruiser just chased um, Oreo out of my room. Eh, it's so funny. These cats can be so hilarious. And they keep trying to get into my mother's room. My mother's not even in there. She just has the door shut. So don't cats can go in there. I'm telling you, these cats can really entertain you. If you love cats, give this video a like and subscribe. I'll make some cat videos. I think Saturday, starting tomorrow, or starting, yeah, starting next Saturday. Saturday will be cat day, where I will, will be filming a lot, filming a lot of my cats. hang out with me and all my cats and talk to them and everything. <laughs> oh. Oh. I'm in the middle of a live. No, not my life. It's not about me. It's another person's life. And you can actually, um, um, while they're, they're live now, they're live now, it's Bay Nation, and they're eating, but I have them paused so they don't talk during my video. I was gonna go live, but they're live, and I don't wanna disrupt their live. I don't think anybody would be visiting my live because they're in her live right now, so. It's okay. I don't need to be live all the time. They go live every day. But then again, so do I. Usually. So. Oh. God help me, Jesus. Mac and cheese are pretty good, but it is better, like 100% better when it's hot. Just saying. But it still is good. I really like it. And I love it when their chicken's cold. It doesn't matter to me. Their chicken is really good. Well, the first bite. Okay. 
um, I have some plans that I want to, I'm trying to, you know, I'm planning in my head that I'm going to get ready for my YouTube channel. So, because you know, I, why not? Why not? Mm. I hope you're enjoying your day. And just know that, even if you're going through something right now, whatever you're going through, it will pass. Just like when. You know, good things happen to us. Like, good things, wonderful things happen to us. But then those those times, they pass. Well, it's just like that with uh, bad times. You're having a bad time. You're in a rough spot right now. But that will pass. And it's okay. Just be patient. And it'll be fine. You're good. <sighs> mm-hmm. Mm. Mm. You know, today I, I did a stupid thing. It was kind of stupid. I want to know if you've done this before. I got in contact with a girl that I know I should not have anything to do with. She wouldn't talk to him. Not because she's a bad, evil person. But she's, she just does, she's, she's kind of a, she's, she has a problem, a narcissistic problem. And there's just a lot of things that are wrong with her. But I noticed that she can't, she gets in contact with me and she wants to be in contact with me when it's convenient for her and when she has something up her sleeve. But like, I wanted to actually, I wanted to message her and see if she would actually not only respond, but if she would ask me the same question in return to see if she actually cared. Because she had mentioned one time that her and I were friends. We're not. So I say, hello, how are you? She was like, hi, and she's like, I'm good. And I'm like, oh, wait, that's great. That's good. Good to hear. And then she, that's it. She doesn't ask me how I'm doing. She doesn't, it's like she doesn't even care. And it's like, wow. Because I was also, if she asked me first, she were to ask me how I was doing. Yes, I will admit, I was tempted to tell her about my YouTube channel and that I'm now monetized. But I know that she wouldn't really be happy for me. In fact, she would be jealous of me and either do nothing and just not say anything and say, oh, good for you, and do nothing, but yet be secretly jealous. Or she will want to know what the YouTube meme is. She'll subscribe and she'll be watching my videos and then she'll unsubscribe later on. And either or she's gonna try to cause trouble or not you know what I'm saying it's like she could she could either if she, with her jealousy she could either it could go either way she could say nothing and just continue to leave you alone and say nothing and be secretly jealous of you and just like Ugh. or she could try to ruin and destroy your channel she'll be look, want to look at your videos to see if you said anything about her or her anyone she knows and she's like, what are your mountains? You know, she could try to destroy that. Because that's the kind of person she is. I didn't tell her. I didn't say anything. After I said that's good. That's it. And she never even asked how I was done. I left it at that and clicked off of Facebook.
even though she says we're friends. She never acts like a friend. She's never there as a friend. And when I confront her about it, I stayed up trying to confront her. She blames everything on me. She makes me feel, that's, leaves me to feel completely like a low life loser. Like I'm a problem. And so, but then after a while of not talking to me and seeing me, hi, how are you? And it's usually because she has something up her sleeve. I've noticed that. But I didn't know if it was all in my head or not. I don't think it is. some good hot chocolate. It was decaf. I to fix myself another one. Oh, so good. I love them. Yeah, I drink, drink the pods. We have a Keurig. And we drink the pods. They're so good. Even the decaf coffee, when it's in the Keurig, it tastes so wonderful better than the instant coffee, whether it's decaf or not, it's so much better. I don't know what it is. But anyways. This is really good. Popcorn chicken. They're supposed to be um, nuggets, but they're the same size as the popcorn chicken. But they don't look like they have popcorn chicken on the, on the site anymore. When I go on to um, Grubhub or DoorDash, I don't see the popcorn chicken on the thing. I don't know what that is. Like, do you have those kind of people in your life? I'm sorry, I'm not trying to change the subject. I keep on, but do you have those kind of people in your life? Where they they want to follow you on social media, they want to be friends with you on social media, and they say and they kind of try to call themselves the you know friends towards you, but they never talk to you. They never ask you how you're doing. Even when you ask them how they're doing, they say fine, and then they don't ever ask you in return. And the only time that they even approach you and say anything to you is if they have something up their sleeve. Does that happen to you? Mm. This is really good. Mm. Not bad, cold. This is 10 out of 10. This is like a mm, mac and cheese is like a 7 out of 10. Maybe a 6. Yeah, I'm gonna say a 6. Mm. But yeah. That was pretty good. There's a right amount too because I wasn't really too hungry. So. Uh. But anyways. Uh. Oh. Well, thank you for joining me and eating my small but delicious meal with me i split it with my mom we there was 12 of these in here but i split them so i ate six and i gave her six and then we split this which is fine with me because i'm not supposed to be eating a whole lot of carbs these are the bad carbs where i just ate but anyways yeah thank you so much for joining me and comment you know let me know what's going on you know Give me your two cents in everything that I shared with you in this video. Alright, and don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, hit that notification bell button, turn on all your notifications. Support me. I love you and thank you. 
and I will see y'all later.